What do you say, everybody? It's time for your favorite show and ours, Beer with Mick and Brickin. What's up? Hey, we are on location right now at Fairhope Brewery in Fairhope, Alabama. We've talked we're, about doing We're this. at the laboratory, right? Yeah. I mean, this is what we talk about <laughs> when we talk about doing research and development. You know, R&D for everybody who's into brevity. Yeah. But, you know, this is, this is where we deal with our Bunsen burners. This is where we deal with our test tubes, our beakers. This is where we do our work. Look, this is a, it's really cool to be here because not only do you get to try the stuff that you can buy in the store, which is one of the beers that we've picked for you today, but you also get to try stuff that you can't get in the store, like this dark beer. It's a coffee stout that I'm over here sipping on called uh, Judge Roy Bean, who was actually a judge a long time ago and then a bar that was... Uh, Famously here and now gone. And look, in this, look, this Judge is a good Roy beer. Beans We're not a, even judging this one. This look, is just, uh, there used to be a goat that ran around Judge Roy Beans when the bar was still up there before it burned down. But Judge Roy Beans was a was a beer that you could buy in the store until Tarts and Crafts took over for the summertime. So they like sometimes to clean your palate, you need like coffee, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. kind of like coffee. Oh, yeah. This is my coffee to clean my palate. Yeah. Right? Well, look, we've done we've done cheap sunglasses by the Fairhope Brewery before. And now here we are with uh, I Drink, Therefore I Amber. Mm -hmm. It's 5.1% alcohol. And uh, look, I'm kind of excited about it. Yeah, no doubt about it. And, we and look, we've got some lab assistants, you know, right back here. You know, they're back here hard at work, making sure that everything that we do meets the qualifications that you guys want to see. Oh, yeah. The real stars of the show are back there. That's right. All That's right. We're just the talent. We're just the ones who are promoting <laughs> everything. They're the ones who are hard at work. So, so this one's brewed right here, and, and you can see it's, it is an amber beer. It's thick. It's, you can't see through the other side of the glass. Uh, really good head. There's some carbonation in there. Yep. It, it doesn't have much of a, a smell to it. And now time to uh, Look, to Look, and, and the reason that we're doing this, guys, is we both had to run separately today. So, we, you know, both our schedules just didn't kind of work out. So I ran a little bit earlier than he did. I had my worst run since I've been here. That's <laughs> <laughs> like He just did what I always did. Yeah. It, today's run was a disgrace. <laughs> I, so I don't even know why. My I'm, run's a disgrace? No, I'm talking about me. <laughs> I, I ran the first half and walked the second half. Like, it took me double time did to do. Did you speed walk? No, I was slow. I, I, okay. It was terrible. Like, I... I made the mistake of eating before I ran, and even though it was eating uh, oysters, it was oysters and mahi on a taco, which is normally delicious, and it was today. It <laughs> wasn't a good idea to try to mix that in with running and now drinking beer. But yeah. with that said, you know, look, I've got my festive Hawaiian shirt on. Yep. I'm hanging out with you guys, and right. now we can try this beer, which I've already tried. And I'm going to tell you something. I like this. Beer. Oh man, it's got a lot of flavor to it. Um, you know, I, I am never. I'm. You know, th there were different ambers that I've that I've had, but um, I'm, I'm not normally an amber person. This is this is a great beer. Yeah, it's a good beer. Um, smooth. It's the whole smooth. Way. Yeah, I and mean, look, I mean, I remember when Kill Killians came out. Mm -hmm. Remember Killians? Is that is that what it was called? Killians. Mm -hmm. Killians. It's Killians. Yeah, Killians. Like way back in the day, like. Well, oh, Killian's my God. was a red. Yeah, well, Killian's red. I'm going to try this Killian's red. Yeah. And, and you would get it, and you know, being an Irish guy, I'm like, oh, i got to have this, <laughs> right? It's an Irish beer. I'm Scottish. So. Yeah, well, yeah. But, but, you know, compared to where we are now with, like, different beers and stuff, and then all of a sudden you, you, you start drinking real beers from Ireland, and, and, and they're amazing, you know, like yeah. uh, Guinness and Harp and stuff like that. Uh, no one really drinks that anymore. Well, you know what's so cool about this place is... You know, you, you come in, I mean, I, I'm sure this is, you know, any brewery that you go about into. talking Killian. Right, right, right. Okay. So any brewery that you go into, you know, th there are only certain beers. And what, what we're wanting to do here is a, what is a beer that you guys can buy, you know, you the fan can go out and, and have, a, have a good time with. But there's a whole lot of other beers that are sitting out here that we're drinking and that we're enjoying too. Yeah. So it's, uh, you know, go to your local brewery. Get, get out, take a run, find that groundhog, go in here, drink you a beer. You, you love know. that groundhog. Oh, man, you lose that belly, find that groundhog. That's what we're doing, man. Yeah, we are yeah. fitness models out here trying to help the common man. That's right. That's well, look, right. this beer is definitely refreshing. Um, it's It's got some body to it. It doesn't, uh, not a whole lot of hops. Not you a whole lot of You wouldn't expect that from an amber, You wouldn't. Right? You wouldn't. It, not a whole lot of carbonation either. It's smooth the whole way through. Um, 
this is going to get a good score for me. What All do you right, think? Go ahead. You go first. You know, I think this is a I think this is a four two five for sure. And I'm going to go like three seven five. Okay. You know, I, I like it. I think it's good. Um, you know, like I'm I'm not a guy that goes out and, and gets a lot of ambers, but yeah, neither am I. But it's am I. something cool about look, it was brewed right back there in that big tank. That's right. right. And it didn't go anywhere. I mean, it basically went from the tank in here, and we're drinking it right yep. now, which is good. It's definitely fresh. Um, it's you know, it's got like I said, it's it's got just enough flavor. I think that you could drink three or four of these, and you'd be feeling pretty good about life. Look, Plus, the alcohol isn't so high that you're getting blown away. Well, that's that's right. I mean, this is one of those beers that you could enjoy a little bit of on um, if you're sitting on the beach, if you're sitting in a, if you're going out and playing golf. This is one of those beers that you you can drink a number of and enjoy. Um, so go ahead. No, I was going to say, make sure you like our page on Facebook. That's right. Check us out on YouTube. Thanks for watching, and we'll keep on drinking these beers and giving you guys a you report. You keep on liking it. We're going to keep on drinking it. All right, guys. Thanks. See ya.